Okay, okay, okay. I want to talk about this Sigma male thing, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm so sick of hearing this stuff, bruh. I'm so sick of you dudes moving the goalposts every time you weak, fake-ass dudes can't, can't get ahead. You just switch up and come up with a new label. I'm going to actually do a Negronomics on the economics of labels. I'm going to do that soon. Because this is all y'all do. Y'all just switch up the label, you know what I'm saying? You're the same person. But you try to put another label on yourself and like that makes you special. You know what I'm saying? Y'all crazy, bro. But let me talk about this Sigma male thing, man, that y'all don't understand is that first of all, it's a myth. There is no such thing as a Sigma male. All they've done is taken all of the qualities of a man that ranks high on the universal law of natural selection and they... They, 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 they separated the fake qualities that usually come with these arrogant asshole type dudes. That's all they did. They took the real, the real characteristics of the alpha male and they re-attributed those to the sigma. And they took the asshole attitudes and characteristics of the fake alpha and attributed that to the alpha, right? For instance, somebody once said something like Future was an alpha. And I, I had to explain to him that dudes like Future are not alphas. You know, y'all seem to think that because a dude is not soft, that means he's an alpha, right? Because a dude is aggressive, that makes him alpha. Alpha males are not aggressive, bro. Alpha males come from a type of environment that if they were aggressive, they would be fighting all day because they're around other alpha males. They are around other men like themselves. You can't be aggressive in those environments because it's not going to work. I mean, and, and what I mean by aggressive, no more so than every other man in that environment is aggressive. But you got to understand that all of these dudes are just like you. I mean, it's like being in the penitentiary, you know what I'm saying? It's full of alpha males, right? And one of the reasons why these dudes maintain peace forever long, it, it lasts, you know what I'm saying? Is because they respect other the other man's alpha they respect the other men and usually when they clash they're gonna get at it because they are the same types of men so i mean it's easy for something to jump off but it's also easy to maintain peace you know what i'm saying so when, when, you, when you talk about alpha males what you're talking really what you're talking about really is just a man that ranks high on the universal law of natural selection there is no sigma in that Sigma is something like the 18th letter of the uh, of the Greek alphabet. You don't want to be that. Alpha is the first letter. Beta is the second. That's where you want to stop. You want to be alpha or beta. You don't want to be Charlie, which is gamma. You don't want to be gamma, delta, or epsilon. You want to be alpha or beta. That's it. You know what I'm saying? Anything under that, you're losing. Well, if you think about it in terms of like, 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 like professional uh, uh, competitions, you got three spots on a podium, right? That would be Alpha, Beta, and Gamma, or Alpha, Beta, and Charlie. So definitely, when you're Delta or Epsilon, you, you damn sure don't want to be that, right? So why would you want to be the 18th letter? What the Sigma male really is, is just a man that's basically failed in life, right? He got a little edge about himself, but he failed in life, you know what I'm saying, because of his own philosophy, his own beliefs. And... <clears throat> And, and right, right now he's trying to, what they're trying to do is they're trying to re-explain why they don't have a woman. Because that's really what it's about. They try to make it sound like, you know, women are intimidated by them. Or, 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 or women just, they, 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 they can sense that they can't walk all over them. So they, they keep walking. And they got all these memes and cartoons of, of or, 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 or screenshots of movies you know what I'm saying I, 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 of men ignoring women and uh, it's crazy bro I ain't ignoring no bitch bro I like women you know what I'm saying if I see a fine chick I'm gonna see a fine chick I ain't ignoring her now I might not jock her I might not go over there and try to sweat her and stuff like that but I mean if she got that ass out I'm gonna look you know what I'm saying y'all not hurting women by boycotting women bro you're hurting yourself this is your one life to live. Obviously, women are important to you because y'all talk about women all day. So, obviously, they are important to you. So, you're not hurting women by boycotting women, bro. What you need to learn how to do is, is, is find some kind of compromise with these women, bro. Now, I'm not saying compromise your principles as far as marriage go. 
But if you just want to have companionship with a female, you're going to learn how to deal. You're going to have to learn how to deal with modern women, period. It's just that simple. There's no if, ands, buts about it, right? That's it. You're going to have to learn how to deal with modern women. You know what I'm saying? So, I mean, but this whole alpha male thing, it's a myth. You know what I'm saying? It's nothing that's real. It's nothing that's true. It's just the white man way of once again moving the goalposts in his favor because he can't he can't claim alpha. He's too soft, right? He's too far behind on, on natural selection. See, the alpha male is the one that women gonna choose. The alpha male is that man y'all talk about how uh, uh, twenty percent of men deal with eighty percent of the women. That is not true, brothers. Stop listening to these people. I don't care if CNN, MSNBC, Fox. I don't care where you hear that shit at. It's not true. First of all, there's no way to quantify that data. Nobody's collecting that kind of data. And I don't know where y'all live at. Y'all must live on the moon if y'all don't see nerdy looking boys or, or men with pretty girls or vice versa. Sometimes you might see a nerdy looking girl with a, with, 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 with a, with a chipper type dude. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you see people coupled up. You see people dating. Y'all must stay inside, man. I don't know which, where y'all live. I don't know. I don't know where y'all reality is. But in, I live in a city city. I live in North Dallas right now, right? I'm from New Orleans. I live in North Dallas. And when I walk around here, when I go to the malls, or I go out, go to the grocery store, I see couples. And I see dudes that look like they dated up real well. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I, I see chubby, out of shape, short dudes with pretty girls fine girls so all of this stuff y'all say about this 80 20 thing is not true man it's just not true it's just not true you know what i'm saying yeah you got certain dudes that got this jenae qua about themselves man but other dudes can win too man there are women out there for the beta male definitely because the beta male is just a beta but there are women out there for the charlie or the gamma male there are women out there for the deltas and the epsilons you know what i'm saying there are women out there for you, bro. Your job is to figure out how to get to your women and know your level. You got to know where your dating range is. And that's part of what the problem is with this Sigma male thing. These are dudes that failed in, in, in one of the most fundamental areas of life, which is dating. I know y'all mad. Y'all just clicked it off. Y'all niggas mad at me already. I know y'all thumb down. But I'm telling you, dating is fundamental because, well, let me revise. Okay, you got me. Okay, brothers, you got me. It's not fundamental no more because women don't follow their nature. Because of the way women operate, dating is, has been thrown out of whack, right? Women are supposed to choose, and these days women are told that they shouldn't choose. That they should wait for a man to chase them. And, uh, and believe it or not, alpha males don't chase either. But the difference is the alpha male will draw the women to him. He has a certain thing about himself that draw women to him. Look, man, since I've been living in this community, bro, throughout the years, it's always some young, fine, fine, fine little white girls that be in the gym. Camera tools, all fat and shit, right? And the dude, the white boys in the gym just be scared to talk to them. And what they end up seeing is the white girls end up talking to an old-ass nigga like me or one of them young brothers. And then they get mad or they just want these black... No! It's the black dudes that pay attention. It's the black dudes that interact with them. It's the black dudes that talk to them. That's all it be. And any man that talk to him, he has a shock because they get ignored by so many men out of fear, out of insecurities, that the man that talked to him got a shot. Truth be told, but it's a great time for men, bro. Great time for men. With so many insecure men out there, but the man that's willing to get shot down, the world is his, bro. I mean, he could be walking around here with 80 women on his arm, bro. The world is his, man, because so many men are too too afraid to get rejected. So that means a man that's not a that's not afraid of rejection, there are women out there for him. And y'all let these old weak niggas talk for y'all talking about man, rejection don't feel good. Man, I never even thought about it, bro. Literally, I get shot down and move on to the next bitch. Straight up, bro. Get shot down again, move on to the next one. I, I never even thought about it, man. It, 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 I'm not psychologically scarred from all the times I've been rejected. I don't even think about it because I've scored so many times. 
I've dated so many women that, I mean, how many times I've been rejected was well worth it. You know what I'm saying? Shit, I don't care. But the Sigma male is a male that's just really afraid of rejection. So he pretends like he's so confident and secure in himself that he don't even pay attention to women. That's not Sigma, that's gay, man. That's what I call that. I got another word for that, not Sigma. I don't know what the hell that is, bro. I'm not going to be in the presence of a fine or pretty or, or attractive woman and not notice her. And I'm not about to go out of my way to pretend like I don't see her. I'm about to let that bitch know I see her. I'm about to look her in her face and look her up and down and let her know I see you. You know what I'm saying? Because I like women and I'm letting them know I like women. Now, if she roll her eyes or turn her head, I leave it alone. You know what I'm saying? If she smile, I still gonna leave it alone. I mean, I, I'm not really on the market like that, you know. If she smile, I'm gonna just smile back and I'm gonna keep stepping, you know what I'm saying? But I'm gonna let them know I see, you know. I did not sleep with all of the women that I have. I did not date all the women that I have by being afraid to pay attention to women. Y'all getting bad advice, my brothers. Y'all getting bad advice. I did not have the life experiences. I would not have had them if I was like these dudes tell y'all to be. If I did like they say do, I could I, I wouldn't have the stories that I can tell. I only have these stories because I didn't do what they say do. I did me. I like women, so I talk to women. This Sigma male thing is a myth. They're trying to move the goalposts. They talk about why people are afraid of Sigma males. Sigma males, the Sigma males, man, nothing, bro. Alpha, man, you want to be first. That's what you want to be. Black alpha. You want to be first, right? You know what I'm saying? You want to be the highest man on natural selection. And any man can achieve that. It's an energy, brothers. It's not, it's, it's not social economic. It's not based on income. It's not based on your religion. You know what I'm saying? Your race got a little, you know, race plays a little part in it. You know what I'm saying? Because it, that, that that's out here. You know, all the other stuff, people got to get to know you to know the other stuff. But they can see your race, you know what I'm saying? And they can feel your energy. So those two things are, are what you work on. And, the, and the, 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 the two men that got it the best, really and truly, are black men and white men. And, and the third man, the, 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 the Charlie and all this shit, will be the Latino. You know what I'm saying? So if you white, black, or Latino, you know what I'm saying? You, the, I mean, the women are out there for you. It's your energy. That's what's messing you up. A cool white boy could smash every woman that I smashed. It don't matter that he's white. If he got that flavor, if he got that energy, he could have done everything I did. Every one of them. The black ones, the Asian ones, the white ones, the, the foreign ones. He could have hit them all too. You know what I'm saying? So, I mean, it don't matter, bro. Because when you're dealing with women, you're dealing with human nature. They are, like I said, there are certain factors that might come into play, but not stuff like income and all this stuff, degrees. They don't know none of that stuff when they meet you. When they see you across that room, they don't know none of that stuff, bro. So their first impression of you is going to be how you look and the energy that you're giving off. That's the first impression. You work on that, you'll get a woman. And even if you got a fuddy-duddy type energy, there's a woman that likes that. Even if you're a softer type dude, there's a woman that likes that. But you got to learn how to pick up cues from women. You got to learn how to at least in I interact, have an eye exchange with women. You don't want to try to be these crazy ass dudes talking about they Sigma male, so I'm going to just ignore a woman. They got these memes where they walking, looking all mean and shit, while the women standing there talking and whispering and shit like, 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 I don't see a woman. Say, hey, buddy, so you want to go through life not seeing them? Good for me. Because I'm going to see them all. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm going to see them all. If you want to pretend like you don't see them, you ignore them, good for me. But then don't get mad when you see them with me. Because that's the next thing you Sigma males do. When y'all see the women walk with a brother like me, then it's, oh, she just want a pookie. No, I'm the man that shot. I'm the man that took the chance. Fortune favors the bold, bro. Y'all heard that. Fortune favors the bold. Closed mouth don't get fed. I mean, shit, this has been said many times, many ways. If you want something, you got to pursue it. You know what I'm saying? It's just simple as that. 
and the people that pursue it, they have a higher chance of getting it than the people that don't pursue it. Duh. I need to say that again, huh? I say that the people who pursue what they want have a higher chance of getting it than the people who don't even bother to pursue it at all. That's just common sense. I'm going to always get more women than a dude that, that, that pretends like he don't see him. I'm going to always have more girls than a dude that pretend he's too good for him. If you're too good, then shut the hell up, man. Be too good. Get off YouTube with all this bullshit and go live your life as a too good single incel. You know what I'm saying? Go live your life. While I'm smashing and dashing. While I'm punishing them out here. You know what I'm saying? I'm doing my thing. You know I, I got a rotation going on. So while you too good to talk to him, I got a rotation going on. Every woman is not for marriage, man. That's another thing I need to talk to y'all about. You don't need to try to meet every woman and talk to her like you're trying to get married to her, bro. You know what I'm saying? It's not about that. You know, you take things in stages, bro. But first thing you gotta learn to do is chill with a chick before you try to build with a chick. Ha! Huh. That's fresh, huh, bro? Yeah, I'm gonna say it again. First thing you gotta learn how to do is chill with a chick before you talk about building with a chick. The building part comes later. First thing you gotta do is learn how to get alone to some degree. You gotta learn how to interact to some degree. So you dudes got a lot of learning to do, man, but get away from this, this, this Sigma male bullshit, bro, because that is not a real thing, man. You know what I'm saying? There is no such thing as a Sigma male. These are just, these are just emasculated, you know what I'm saying, uh, 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 failed white men that's once again trying to control a narrative because that's what they do. They can't control reality, so they always try to control the narrative. It's just what white boys do, bro. That's a white boy thing, man. And you got this pretty sister online that always talk about Sigma male sisters. Sit down somewhere with that shit, man. You know what I'm saying? Sit down somewhere with that, man. You don't know what you're talking about. Sigma males ain't. Sigma males don't exist, man, in the world of the alpha. It's alpha, beta, and sometimes Charlie. That's it. That's three slots you can get in, bro. If you can't fit in one of them three slots, you're doing something wrong. <clears throat> Every man should be able to make the podium. Every man should be able to make the podium. But the problem is y'all all, all want to be first. Suppose it's not in your cards to be first. Suppose it's not even your cards to be second. You got to learn how to accept where you are. Look at the kinds of women you attract. Look wise, right? Look at the kind of women you could keep around and date. This tells you everything you need to know. But the one thing you can't do is just tell yourself in your mind that the reason why I, I can't get a woman is because I'm too good. Okay, keep telling yourself that, bro. Keep telling yourself that. You know what I'm saying? Keep keep on lying to yourself. But all I know is you're letting your one, one life pass you by with this old Sigma male stuff, man. There ain't no such thing as a Sigma. You know what I'm saying? And I'm, I hate to break it to you. That's the bold, ugly truth about it. Sigma male does not exist, man. It's Alpha, Beta, and Charlie, or Gamma. That's it. You got Delta and Epsilon, but, you know, I still don't believe you want to be Delta and Epsilon, but you know what I'm saying? I mean, they there. There's nothing else outside of that, bro. That's five classes of men. You don't need to make 18 classes. You know what I'm saying? Five classes is stretching it. So anyway, I just want to get that out, man. You know what I'm saying? Do a quick, a, 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 a quick introduction on why you shouldn't fall for the Sigma male thing. Because these characteristics that they're trying to attribute to the Sigma male, that's just alpha characteristics. And the characteristics that they're trying to re-distribute uh, uh, to, 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 to the, to, uh, re-attribute to the alpha male, that's not alpha male. Pe men like Future are not alphas. They betas. At best. At best. They betas. Because you know... A man like Future, he might actually be kind of high on natural selection, right? Right, as far as physically, you know, he moves a certain way. Women might, women might actually like him. I don't see how, but they might actually. I, I don't, from what I see, I don't see how. But they might actually like him, right? But here's the next thing, though, about the alpha male. Alpha male keep women. Alpha male, he's the kind of man that once women, the more a woman gets to know him, the more she likes him. That's the alpha. The more a woman get to be in his in his orbit, the more she wants to be in that orbit. And even when she 
finally let society pull her apart or feminism pull her apart she still tries to stay connected to the alpha that's why i still talk to all my exes right now this is why they still call me right now because the longer they dealt with me the more they wanted to deal with me and even after it was officially over after i had to break it off because of the activities they still stay in touch with me because this is how women respond to an alpha for them it's never really over with the alpha because the alpha represents something to them you want to be that man or at least the beta or the charlie you want to stop there if you can but there is no sigma male bro it just don't exist man and this 80 20 thing is not true there's no way to quantify that there's no way to keep that kind of data or track that kind of data it's just silliness man it's like most things somebody just pulls something straight out their ass and all you do is repeat it to try to justify why you don't have a woman instead of you saying to yourself well if if 20 percent of the men getting 80 percent of women then how do i become one of the 20. see that's what i'll be saying I wouldn't be sitting around here single as a, a, a damn incel and just sit there and cry about it. About, oh man, you know, 20% of the men get 80% of the women. I wouldn't be doing that. I'd be like, well shit, what the 20 doing that I'm not doing? So I know how to, you know, get in the game. But for y'all, y'all have convinced yourself that to be one of the 20, you gotta demean yourself. You gotta be a pookie. You gotta be a Ray Ray. You gotta be broke. You gotta be a drug dealer. Listen, if women want them kind of men, y'all shouldn't want them kind of women. Period. So you should be better off. You should be happy that you are uh, that, that you're not one of those 20 and you should just be an incel and be happy you can't have it both ways make your mind up which way you want to go man but on that note i'm gonna stop there man you know what i'm saying i didn't want to rant and rave too much because this sigma male topic i'm gonna come back to it because i got some stuff to say about it you know what i'm saying it's a, it's a good topic it's one of them topics that that really needs to be addressed in detail in depth but I didn't want to go into it in the first video in depth. I just want to touch on the good, the bad, and the ugly, so to speak. You know what I'm saying? The good is, you know, the, the Sigma male, what they call a Sigma. The, the attributes that they're trying to um, give to the Sigma, they're really just alpha male attributes. That's all they are. And the, the bad is the attributes that they're trying to give to the alpha, they're not alpha attributes at all. They're Charlie. Delta Epsilon type attributes. They, they, don't, they don't belong to the alpha male at all. And another ugly thing about it is that the reality of the Sigma male is that they're just a bunch of failed dudes that are trying to control the narrative regarding their their uh, inevitable uh, 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 in, 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 uh, inevitable date with incel, <laughs> with being an incel, you know what I'm saying? They're trying to control that narrative ahead of time because of the direction they're going, that their life is going in. I'm telling y'all, there's a woman out there for you. I'm telling you, brother. There, there are women out there for you. You'll be surprised at what you can smash if you, if you get out of your head, if you get out of these statistics, if you get out of this bullshit. You will be surprised at what you can pull. I'm telling you, man. I'm telling you from experience. You'll be surprised at what you can pull if you only try now you think about the kind of man you want to be you want to be the 18th or you want to be the first the elf on that note i'm out of here i'm brother kush aka the black elf salam <laughs>